In this video, we're going to talk about how to divide mixed numbers using cross-cancellation. In order to divide these two mixed numbers, we need to convert them to improper fractions. So let's go ahead and do that. Let's rewrite the denominator. Next, we'll multiply the whole number by the denominator and then add the numerator. 6 times 4 is 24 plus 3, that's 27. Let's do the same for the second mixed number. 8 times 1 is 8 plus 7, that's 15. So now we're dividing two fractions. We want to convert this division problem to a multiplication problem using the expression keep, change, flip. So we'll keep the first fraction the same, change division to multiplication, and then we're going to flip the second fraction. Now, before we multiply across, let's see if there's anything we could cancel. 27 and 15, they share a common factor of 3. 8 and 4 share a common factor of 4. So 27, I'm going to write that as 9 times 3. And 4, I'm going to leave that as 4 times 1. 8, I'm going to write that as 4 times 2. And 15 as 3 times 5. So we could cancel a 4. And we could cancel a 3. So now let's multiply across. 9 times 2 is 18. 1 times 5 is 5. So we have the answer as an improper fraction, 18 over 5. Now let's convert this to a mixed number. What is the highest multiple of 5 just under 18? That's going to be 15. 18 minus 15 is 3. So we could break up 18 over 5 into 15 over 5 plus 3 over 5. 15 over 5, if you divide the 2, you get 3. So we have 3 plus 3, 3 fifths. Now, when you have a whole number and a fraction, you can now write that as a mixed number. This is 3 and 3 fifths. So that is the answer as a mixed number.